So this is the surgeon's console where the surgeon will sit and he will operate and uh, this particular console uh, will have a 3D vision. These are the foot pedals which the surgeon has. So surgeon is sitting here and as you can see in the PIP the movement which the surgeon is doing has a 360 degree articulation. So he's sitting relaxed, no stress on the shoulders, on the arms and performing the surgery and at the same time you can see in the PIP the robotic arms are doing the same action which the surgeon there is sitting and doing and uh, these are the powerful robotic arms which does not have tremors like the surgeon's hands so you have the precision I'm Dr. Mohit Bandari I'm a bariatric metabolic and a robotic surgeon based at Mohawk Bariatrics and Robotics which is an international center of excellence at Mohawk Hospital which is an international center of excellence we have been doing bariatric and metabolic surgery by laparoscopic method since last five years now and last one year we have started uh, robotic surgery at our center and this has become one of the most sought for center for robotic weight loss surgery. Uh, today in this particular film I will take you through the robotic weight loss surgery as in the patient entry and to the end of the robotic weight loss surgery. Just to make this video more informative, more simple for the general public to understand as in what is the actual way by which robotic weight loss surgery is being performed and also to understand the nuances which exist with the robotic surgery. Most of the patients have asked us before that they think that the robotic surgery means that the surgeon is not operating but the robot is operating and the general public and also some medical professionals have the misconception and they do not understand robotic surgery completely. So this particular video is being recorded just to explain the patients and to the general public at large about robotic weight loss surgery there is always a question which the general public asks when we explain them that apart from the laparoscopic weight loss surgery, we also have the robotic method of weight loss. Now what is the advantage of robotic weight loss surgery vis-a-vis -vis, uh, laparoscopic surgery? The robotic weight loss surgery has the advantage of being more precise, lesser blood loss, lesser pain, lesser hospital stay and you know I have always said that in any weight loss surgery what matters is the kind of anastomosis or the joint to speak in general language we make between the stomach and the small bowel. Now that particular joint or the anastomosis which we make between the small bowel or the small intestines and the stomach might enlarge with time and that is what we can avoid by doing a robotic surgery where we make a very precise anastomosis which is calculated, which is calibrated and which is being made with topmost care and precision. The other thing is the blood loss. When we are able to see that 3D enlarged HD vision, the way we look at vessels, small venules and arterioles, we are not able to look at the same way as in laparoscopy. So we have a 3D a HD a enlarged, the best possible vision available on this earth and that helps us to tackle those small vessels which bleed with time very carefully and meticulously. The pain is obviously less because we don't use our hands and put a lot of pressure on the small trocars which we put in to operate but that particular weight which is put on the trocars has now been borne by the strong robotic arms. So all in all together a very precise, a very effective, a bloodless, a neat and clean surgery which is obviously calibrated to the most level so that it can give us the most precise results. So that's the advantage. We have been doing these studies where we have compared the laparoscopic method of weight loss with the robotic method of weight loss and in our small series, although small, but with a good follow up, we have realized that the patients are much more comfortable and they maintain their weight much better by the robotic weight loss surgery. Today we are going to show you a procedure where a super obese patients have been put to sleep for doing a robotic gastric bypass. I'll explain you how we do the anastomosis and the 360 degree articulation and the rotation of the robotic arm helps us in perfect suturing.